bulky humor too. And um, I'm gonna be doing a new LP just cause um, uh, I don't know, I, I just felt like it. I felt like doing more than one game for um, those of you who really don't know anything. Um, no, I'm just kidding, but today I'm gonna take you to the world into the world of Sinnoh. <laughs> so yeah, there's gonna be a lot of stuff where he's gonna tell you where you're gonna have to actually touch the screen because um, this is the first game where I'm uh, um yes, I am actually a boy. And, um... Um... Yeah, I guess I'll just name myself... I don't know, let's go crazy and let's just... I don't know, name myself Ed. I don't know. So, um, uh... Yeah, my name is actually Edward. So, um, uh... Yeah, in case you're wondering. And I'm just gonna name him Barry, because that's his name. Alright, Ed, the time has come. Your very own tale. Adventure is about to unfold. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> no one really cares about this, no, do we? <sighs> Despite the exploration, Team's best efforts, however, they're rare. Oddly colored Pokemon eluded detection. The rumored Red Gyarados failed to appear, even fleetingly, to the crestfallen team. Ooh, scary. That concludes our special lore. Blah, 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 blah. Alright, now the first thing you're gonna want to do, of course, um... You're gonna, you know, change all that crap around. And I'm just gonna change the frame to something that I like. Uh, okay, whatever, that's okay. Okay, I actually have to stack this on some books just because, um... Yeah, that's how I record. I'm actually recording with my phone right now, and as you can imagine... Um, it's, uh, it's a little difficult, so. Oh, guys, don't check your PC. There's no potion in there. X button opens the menu. Oh, look at that. The menu. Okay. Now, you're gonna go downstairs, and your mom is gonna walk into some invisible walls you just saw. Barry was calling for us a little while ago, and, yeah, she, she doesn't really know what it's about or anything, but apparently it's an emergency, so... You know, we're gonna go check out who this berry guy is. And, uh, yeah. Man, yeah, we can't go into the tall grass because, you know, we'll run into some wild Pokemon. Um. So, yeah, this is, uh, um, Barry's house is over here. Thud. So, yeah, he just comes out and runs right into you, like. Alright, let me hold on. Alright, I think it's a tiny bit better. So, he's gonna find us, um, $100 million if we're late, so, uh... Uh, <laughs> which, uh, is just completely ridiculous, so... Yeah, let's go up here, because... I better take my bag and my journal, too. Oh, hey, we're going to the lake. Ten million if you're late, so yeah. The price just suddenly shot right up, um... But I don't care, he can find me all he wants, I'm not gonna pay anything to him. Cause he's Barry. Alright, and uh, that guy you just saw over there, he'll actually stop you. Um, if you didn't, you know, do all this Barry stuff, so... So, yeah. Oh, look, walk through walls. We're actually walking right through him right now. That's, that's cool. Whatever.
And um, yeah, let's go walk into some trees now, because that's fun. What's going on? So yeah, um, the girl you see on the right is um, Dawn, and the person you see on the left is actually the professor. Um, you know, because every game has a professor. Except his name isn't after a tree. <laughs> his name is actually Professor Roan, in case you didn't know. And, um... So yeah, they're really just dumb enough to leave their suitcase out, like... Like, no, you don't, you don't just leave a suitcase out like that, like... What are you doing? But, um... But yeah. And then these two starlies just pop up, they're like... Whoa, po po Pokemon! So yeah. And um, as you can see here, this is the uh, Turtwig. Uh, this is Turtwig. This is Chimchar. This is Piplup. I will be choosing my Pokemon in the next episode. No, I'm just kidding. Um. I'm gonna be choosing Turtwig, so yeah. Ah, uh, yeah. I recommend you just use Tackle, especially. Um, I mean, like Turtwig's other move is Withdraw, which is really pointless because the Starly's tackle only does one damage anyway. So yeah, this is a really easy battle, and if you can't win, if if this battle, well, here, I'll, let me say it like this: if you're having trouble with this battle, then um, I I really don't know what to tell you. Okay, this is probably the easiest battle in the entire game. Um. And yeah, if you if you're having difficulty, I don't know what to tell you. And um, of course, he just happens to choose the Pokemon that's strong against ours, which it happens to be Chimchar, the Fire type. But whatever. Um, Turtwig's last evolution is actually a Ground type, so you know we can you know use Earthquake on his um Infernape, which is Chimchar's last evolution. But um. Uh, yeah, usually Infernape is um, a pretty fast Pokemon, so... Um... Yeah. And actually, let's check out our Pokemon. Tibbin Nature likes sweet food. And I don't know what that does. Often scatters things. What? Um, yeah, let's just continue. Hmm, I heard from Don that you used our Pokemon. Let's, let me see them, please. Hmm, Turtwig and Chimchar. Dot, dot, dot. Hmm, dot, dot, dot. So, yeah. So yeah, basically, they're just like... They're basically just like, oh, you chose Chimchar. How interesting. <laughs> so yeah, your mom's just in here. What's up, dear? Dot, dot, dot. Wow, I can't believe that happened to you. Like, we didn't even say anything. She just read our minds, and she knows everything. Am I ever glad that you were both there, whatever, whatever. <laughs> Alright, and then she gives you a pair of running shoes when she's all, when she's done telling you that, so, um. Um, yeah, you can actually run inside in this game, so, um. Yeah, in the next episode, we're gonna go check out the professor's lab. Thank you for watching, and stay, um, next episode's gonna be soon.